the biggest mistake parents make with their adult children. Hello y'all, I'm Diana Breanne. I don't give advice, suggestions, information, recommendations. I do share with you my perspective on different topics. I hope you like, share, subscribe. All five channel names pinned to the top of the comments section or description box below. All five channels have fresh, new, and different content from each other. So I got to thinking about the biggest mistake that I see that, that parents make with their adult children. Time and time again, I hear, I'm so disappointed that my kids, adult children, are not supportive of me, um, are not there for me in the way I think they should be. I hear that all the time. Now, do I also hear occasionally, hey, I've got these great kids, they're always here for me? Absolutely. Do I know adult children who are always there for their parents and are amazing and wonderful? Absolutely. I know quite a few. And yet, and I was one of them with my mom. I was always there 100% for my mom. And she was always there for me as well. And yet, I think that parents often put expectations upon their adult children who really simply many times just want to live their own life. And yes, they want their parents as part of their life, but they don't want to be responsible in many ways. And often they don't even really want to be there in a time of need. I've seen it time and time again. And maybe you can call them selfish children and maybe that's what they are. I don't know because I was not one of them. I was an adult child who looked over my mom, especially in her old years to make sure that everything was right for her and so yet I see so often the situation that's not like that that the adult children you know call on Mother's Day or Father's Day and send a package at Christmas but beyond that there's not a lot of daily contact or daily support and I think often when we begin to expect that from our adult children often we can become disappointed when we don't expect it and we rely upon our own selves or have built in um, other ways of support. Often when our children do step up or if they do step up, that's amazing and that's wonderful and we're very happy about that. And yet, if they don't, we're not so disappointed. And so I do think that that's one of the biggest mistakes that older parents make or parents with adult children make is that they they have these expectations, whether they're realistic, whether they're, they're okay, um, but often those adult children will disappoint them. So not putting those expectations, I think, are better and building our own lives, not expecting our adult children to always be there for us in the ways that we think that they should be. And instead, I think building our own support network to the very best of our ability in hopes that maybe our kids will show up and be there for us. Okay, from my house to yours, may God bless you. I hope you like, share, subscribe, and I hope to talk to you soon again. Bye-bye.